Welcome to this yin healing for everyone. It's just going to be a quickie using energetic medicine and some card wisdom and myself. Thank you for joining me. I hope you're all doing really well wherever you are in this beautiful world. Just closing your eyes and connecting in with the region just below where the pubic hair starts. So a little bit lower, about a thumb width below. Focusing in on this place here. It's a place that's so important for nourishing the yin, allowing intuition, the softness, the moisture, the darkness, the surrender. It's beneficial for times of stress and overwhelm because the yin gets disturbed when we're in this state. This state is a really heightened yang state and it depletes our yin. So just focusing in on that place, just over the pubic bone, below where the hair is. Allowing yourself to connect with your breath. Allowing yourself to feel into what success means to you. Asking yourself if you're angry with your lack of success. Tuning in to how you feel about plans being changed. Do you find it hard to change your plans? That feels to be the unanimous yes today or do you always find yourself compromising there's a little bit of that but I think we're going to focus on I find it hard to change my plans so just allowing the breath to be slow and deep with your eyes closed this is a journey for you to connect with yourself deeper and your yin, your feminine, your most nourishing, soft needs for you right now. Imagine yourself on a journey and you're journeying along a pathway. You're walking, you're moving, you're flowing and you're going deeper along this pathway and you're going deeper into the earth. You can smell the earth, you can feel the earth, you can hear the earth and you can sense how the earth is feeling and you're going deeper into the earth deeper into the mother until you come to a place it's like a cave it's like a magical cave and inside this special cave you find that you are actually inside of yourself and in this place is your core. It's your heart, it's your knowing, it's your, it's your navel, your connection to life, where we came from our mothers on the umbilical cord. And you're here surrounded by the core essence of yourself. And I want you to get comfortable. I want you to sit down with yourself like you're sitting down with your old best friend from year five or when you were five or someone that you just adore and you're sitting next to them, imagining that you're with someone that just lights you up. 
and you're connecting with everything in your essence that makes you you. In this place, you feel at home. And if you don't feel at home, I want you to embrace the belief of feeling at home within yourself. Allowing yourself to love every bit of you, to accept your imperfections, to adore your perfections, and in this beautiful cave, this essence, this core, this magnificent place which is everything that you are there's a beautiful vibration and it's feeling is wrapping around you it's moving through you it's coming down into your crown chakra it's going through all of your cells it's coming up from the earth through your base chakra. It's tingling. This frequency and energy is buzzing through you, buzzing around you, coming through you, from you. It's all around you. And as you stay connected with the breath, and you come to a place of awareness of the heart space, you realize what this energy is. It's the potential that you have within you. It's the seed of creation. It's the act of creativity and creating new life and new projects and fertility. It's delicious. It's fluid, it's abundant, and it's right within you, right within you, right within you. This potential is buzzing through you, around you, from you, into your crown and into your base, buzzing with the most delicious potential for all that you desire and all that you dream and all that you are and all that you want to be. Allowing this expansion of potential to keep flowing around you and through you as you start to say thank you to this cave, this core within yourself as you start to slowly get up with all of this potential within you, this awakened excitement and buzz as you start to spiral, as you get up, just having a mini, mini kind of improvised moment of movement allowing yourself to spiral and move as if you're mixing all of the ingredients, all of this potential within you. And you start to move towards the entrance. You smell the earth, you hear the earth, you sense what the earth is feeling and you start to walk back upwards on the pathway, emerging through earth, rebirthing yourself and your full potential. There is more light, and more sounds of the earth above, water flowing, a breeze in the air the warmth of the sun as you come back to the beginning where it all began 
you have this new awakened potential and buzz within you and you're looking around at the earth the trees seem greener the birds chirp sweeter you feel more connected to the earth you feel nourished and rested and rejuvenated and you welcome the stillness as well the yin element is all about stillness allowing surrender And it's all about coming into a place of the heart, which is a card that I just drew. It's the center, the home. So the heart is often reclaimed when we connect with nature, music and dance and the presence of children or animals. So calling in all of this heartfelt energy into your world, into your love, your love into your heart, into your life. Allowing any tangles and knots to detangle, to unknot, to fall away, into flow. Allowing this precious heart, this, this cosmos awaiting for your return. Connecting with the breath. As we allow the frequency to move through us. As we allow ourselves to be more fluid with our planning. To know that we can make plans and, and then life happens and that is okay. To allow ourselves to surrender to what is. To let the state of obligations and compromise fall away allowing your needs to be met just through projecting it out there into the world, asking for what you need energetically, mentally, verbally, physically, calling it all towards you with ease and grace, allowing any anger to dissolve if you feel angry at your lack of success, Allowing that full potential and buzz to move into the realm of success for you. Allowing this abundance of creation to move through you into your fertility and creativity. Calling in life in its highest vibration. And giving that place just below the pubic hairline another little rub with the edge of your pinky. Bringing your hands to stillness over your pubic area, connecting in with all that you have felt today. Into the bliss of who you are and the magnitude of all that is within you. And allowing it to come forth allowing it to be shared, allowing it to be created and manifested and coming back to the breath, coming back to your body, just giving your legs a slight massage, rowing your hands up all over yourself, connecting in with your arms, the heart meridian down the pinky side, ends in the armpit, just giving that armpit a bit of a massage activating the, the heart meridian. 
bringing your hands into prayer if you wish at the heart <sighs> allowing your breath to be natural allowing some sighs of excitement joy relief love Thank you, opening your eyes when you're ready. I'm Kyla Aditi and this was an energetic medicine journey. I'll see you again soon. Enjoy the rest of your day or night wherever you are.